Look what I just found out. I figured it would have screwed uh, the top part in tighter, but I guess not. I don't even think it's supposed to be moving like this. Like I said, I'm going to get a short throw shifter anyway, but you could grab it from down here. You could start turning it and stuff like that. Plus, I don't know. It's just weird. Maybe something's loose down below in the assembly part. I couldn't tell you. Because, because you could yank up on it. On the shaft itself. So I don't know if it's about to come out or what. Oh well. I figured out how to pop open the uh, case and stuff like that. I'll hold this open with my knee. It's pretty much... That looks like it's... Does that look like it's coming out? There we go. Look, I could probably yank it out. I don't know if it's broken or, or what. I actually made this video early this afternoon. But I thought I hit the record button, but it actually I took a picture instead. And it was a picture of this. I don't know why, and I kept talking and thinking it was, I was recording. But, um, yeah, I ordered a works short throw shifter knob yesterday. I'm having it sent up to my buddy in Connecticut, Eric. I'll have him throw it in and stuff like that. I've been taking it very, very easy while shifting because this is just ri ridiculous. And every time I shift, it does turn like this every once in a while. So I've been shifting like this. Like, I think this is like some kind of Hawaiian sign for something or other, like cowabunga or something like that. So I've been shifting like this. It's just, uh, it's a mess right now. I did not hear it snap. I did not hear the shaft bend, buckle or whatever. Um, I did take apart the console so I could do a deep clean, um, which I'm happy because right in, in the crevice... It was like um, um, French vanilla coffee that was in there, and it stunk because the young girl at Dunkin' Donuts didn't put the uh, cover on t tight enough last year, like November or December. And uh, when I was getting out of the car to pick up the thing, the lid popped off and coffee everywhere. So I was actually going to stick this in the dishwasher, but I don't know if it would fade, fade the black or what so I just took my time and I did a nice deep clean of the console which I'm happy and I also did the top part of the dashboard along with the other little odds and ends in here so the links will be in the description below as to where I bought the short throw shifter I got it from works I got a works one um, there's so many short throw shifters out there I didn't know if torque solutions was the best one but I had my eye on works so that's what I went with. It was like 278 bucks. Comes with the bushings and everything. I opted out of the shift knob because I want to keep this one. But uh, for the time being, I'm going to be taking it very easily. I should have just had it shipped down here with a short throw. But I mean, my parents have the tools. My father has the tools. But my friend Eric, he loves to work on cars. He works at a dealership, and uh, it's therapeutic to him, I guess, to work on cars. So I don't mind throwing him a few extra bucks here and there. But even if I didn't, he'd still be willing to work on the car for me. And I'm sure I'm going to get flamed in the in the comments. So you, bro, you don't even work on your own car? This and that. But I live in a condo. I don't have the room for tools or at all. Anyway, so that's one of my excuses. So, But it doesn't mean I could always go out and buy like a small little tool thing and throw it in the trunk but I never think to do it also these these are from um, uh, I forgot but they smell terrific um, I'll leave the link in the description for them because um, these are the ones my friend Josh and Heather told me to get and I love them they're Old Spice actually Old Spice makes these so I'll leave the link for that I'd, I like to keep my car nice and smelly Smelly, nice and clean and stuff like that. So that's the story. So any questions, comments, concerns, I'll, I'll talk to you guys later. 
I just, like, again, I had no idea this was like this. I brought my car down for an oil change Thursday. He was fine. Friday through Saturday, I just noticed this. And um, as you see in the in the clips earlier, you'll see that I could I could raise this up and down. And I'm not going to do it now because I'm afraid I'm going to just going to fall off or something like that. So, at any rate, guys, take care.